Science 4. Weather Instruments. Objectives. At the end of the lesson, you should be able to identify the weather instruments used to measure the different weather components and tell the importance and use of each weather instrument. The Philippines is always visited by tropical cyclones, commonly known as typhoons. In a year, around 20 typhoons enter Philippine waters. In the event of any typhoon, it is wise to watch or listen to news updates about the weather. How do the people of Pagasa gather data about weather conditions? What do they use to describe the water for the day? Yes, they use some weather instruments. This week, you will discover how simple and basic instruments are used to gather data for the different components of weather. Weather instruments are very useful in describing the weather. Here are the different weather instruments and their uses. A thermometer is an instrument that is used to measure the temperature in the air. The liquid inside the tube of a thermometer may be alcohol or mercury, which expands when it is hot and contracts when it is cool. When the bulb of the thermometer is exposed to warm surroundings, the molecules expand and go up the tube of the thermometer. The higher the level of the liquid, the higher the temperature of the air. A wind vane is an instrument that is used to determine the direction of the wind. It specifically tells the direction where the wind is coming from. Thus, a northeast reading means that the wind is coming from northeast of where you are and heading in a southwest direction. A wind vane has a simple design that allows free movement. The design has unequal ends to enable the end with the smaller area to turn toward the wind. Generally, it has an arrowhead on one end and a big tail on the other. The wind pushes on the arrowhead and aligns the arrow to its path. The position of the arrowhead then tells the observer where the wind is coming from and where it is going. The direction is identified by the north end, south, s, east, e, and west, w, marks on the round-shaped stand of the wind vane. An anemometer is used to measure how fast the wind moves. The more spins that an anemometer does per minute, the greater the wind speed. It is estimated that 10 turns per minute means that the wind is moving at 1.6 km per hour. A barometer measures air pressure. A rising barometer means sunny and dry conditions, whereas a falling barometer means stormy and wet conditions. A rain gauge measures the amount of rainfall. Light rains have a rate of fall from trace to 2.5 mm per hour. Trace means that the amount of rain is not enough to be measured by the rain gauge. The rate of fall of moderate rain is between 2.5 mm and 7.5 mm per hour. The rate of fall of heavy rain is greater than 7.5 mm per hour. A hygrometer measures the amount of humidity or moisture in the air as relative humidity. Relative humidity is the ratio of the moisture in the atmosphere to the maximum amount of moisture that the atmosphere can hold. The average and most comfortable reading of relative humidity in a hygrometer ranges between 30% and 60%. Scientists use an instrument called nephilometer to measure the extent of cloudiness in the sky. A weather satellite is a type of satellite that is used to monitor the weather and climate on Earth. It carries instruments that collect information about the atmosphere. Satellite images are used to provide information for places where observations cannot be made from the ground. Remember. Meteorologists are specialists who study processes in the Earth's atmosphere that cause weather conditions. Meteorologists use instruments such as the thermometer, wind vane, anemometer, barometer, rain gauge, hygrometer, nephilometer, and weather satellite. To check how well you understood the lesson, let us have a short exercise. Identify the weather instrument being described in each number. 
complete the following sentences. 1. And blank is used to measure how fast the wind moves. 2. The correct answer is anemometer. 2. A. Blank measures air pressure. 3. The correct answer is barometer. 3. A. Blank measures the amount of rainfall. 4. The correct answer is rain gauge. 4. A. Blank measures the amount of humidity or moisture in the air as relative humidity. The correct answer is hygrometer. 5. A. Blank is an instrument that is used to determine the direction of the wind. The correct answer is wind vane.